bodies are hitting the floor today. Damn power! Damn power! Damn power! Damn power! Damn power! Oh good. Harder than these guys hit. What's going on? My name's Chad Mueller. Work, Trey! Get out of there! Push me off the throw! I'm the owner here at Maryville Muay Thai. We've had this gym now for going on almost 11 years. That helps. Uh, for the first, like, nine years, we were like a cardio fitness gym because that's where the money was at. You know, I always heard, like, you can't make money with a fight gym. Uh, but we just started the fight team, like, two years ago. So we had a really good group of guys here training really hard, pushed each other. And it's just a fun atmosphere that people want to be at. Oh, you know, I wanted to uh, do what I wanted to do. I, like, I wasn't passionate about like helping people lose weight. I wanted to teach people to fight and find confidence in that and go travel the world and do cool stuff. Get progression of Aaron of the first round. So look how fresh he is. Let's see, let's see what happens. Always fresh. He ain't got shit for him. Bad, bad, bad hit. Ready? Start it. Right punch! Yeah, yeah, oh, hey, oh, kick! Two rounds. <laughs> Shut up. Woo. Where's Sean at? You know, yeah. feels good sometimes. Go! Round three! Go! Up! 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 Give me confidence, give me fit. I mean, that's, that's all he, and he knows what he's doing. He's an experienced guy. And, uh, he's definitely taking all of us, especially Trey, me, to the next level. Hey, Chad. Let's go. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to whoop Trey's ass today. Man. I don't know if you saw the last vlog, he was, he was talking smack, because sometimes you get to let your fighters kind of beat up on you, you know, get their confidence up. And uh, we're going to break them today. Hard kick, get kick, hard kick. I retired two years soon. Oh, oh big, 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 big punch from Lewis. Oh, he's, 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 he's out. He's out. He's, he's not out. He's not out. He is out. I just came back from Thailand, lived over there for a couple months. Um, and I had just uh, won one of my fights over there. I fought a guy in Compeche. Hey, Trey, and I dislocated my right knee. 
Uh, this was the fourth time it's happened. So it's been 15 years since I've done it. So I thought I was like over it. My knee's just not the same. Like it's not strong like it should be. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, go. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hey. Never show your opponent you're tired. That's the biggest mistake you can make in a fight is show them you're tired. They're gonna take advantage, it gives them fuel. Like it's like a shark smelling blood. They see you're tired, they're gonna go off. You have to have a poker face when you fight. I uh, fucked some people up, didn't get hit once. I feel great, honestly. Best night of my life. Even if you get hit, you can't show it hurt. If you show it hurt, show you're tired, it's gonna be a bad day in the office. So one of the things I don't want is for my fighters to have regret. You know, look back 10 years from now and, and wish they would have done more with their life and wish more they, they would have trained harder and, and gone further in fighting and seen what they were doing um, because I want them to have no regrets in life. And that's why I ended up going back to Thailand and training and fighting over there is I didn't want to be an old man laying in my deathbed and wishing I would have done the things that I wanted to do and I don't want that for these kids. So that's why I push these kids so hard. That's why I, I make them work and push through pain and adversity is no, no regrets.